So today I'm going to share with you how to get clear and crisp audio with your Insta360 ONE R and Rode Wireless GO. So let's get started. So one of the biggest issues we had with the old 360 cameras is trying to get really good sound quality. Now luckily with the Insta360 ONE R you can buy additionally an external mic adapter. So you can plug in the Rode Wireless GO. So I wanted to find a solution with the ONE R and Wireless GO, which was portable and easy to set up so we could use it for vlogging and journalism. And I think I found the solution. It's what I'm using right now. So let me show you how to set this up. So for this setup, I am using a quarter inch to quarter inch male adapter. I am using a 3.5 millimeter male to 3.5 millimeter male one meter audio cable. I'm using a cold shoe mount with a quarter inch 20 screw thread on the bottom and the Insta360 mic adapter. So how do you put this all together? So I have the one art on a selfie stick and I'm going to screw in the quarter inch screw thread adapter into the bottom of the selfie stick. And then I'm going to screw in the cold shoe mount. And then I'm going to clip the Rode Wireless Go into the cold shoe mount. And then I'm going to open the battery door of the ONE R. Now this battery door is quite annoying because if you leave it as it is, then it's going to keep hitting the side of the cage and you will hear that sound in your final audio. So if you want to stop that from happening, then here's a tip for you. All you need to do is tug on the battery door and take it out. And don't worry, you can put it back in, so keep it safe. Next, I'm going to plug in the Insta360 mic adapter. And then I'm going to get one end of the cable and plug it into the adapter and extend the selfie stick by about one and a half. And now I'm going to carefully wrap the cable around the selfie stick, especially at the top because we want to hide this in the stitch line. Just wrap it all the way around. And then I'm going to plug it into the Rode Wireless Go. Now I'm going to tense the wire by stretching the selfie stick longer and then locking it into place. So now you can see the cable is running through the stitch line with the selfie stick, making it entirely invisible. So now if you hold it over here, you can walk and talk and you have an invisible setup with really crisp and clear video and audio. Now the last thing you need to do on the Rode Wireless Go is over here, it says DB settings. You need to change the DB settings to high and not low or medium. If you're gonna use low or medium, then the audio will come out really low in the ONE R app and on your desktop editing software. So make sure to set this to high and you'll get really crisp and clear audio in the ONE R app and in your desktop video editing software. So this is this setup done. Now let me show you another setup. I think it's even easier if you put the ONE R on a monopod and just leave it there. And I think I found an easier setup because now you don't need wires I just bought an additional accessory from AliExpress and then attached the wireless go. So this is how this setup is done. So you can walk and talk around your camera and explain things absolutely hands-free. For this setup, I'm going to use a 3.5 millimeter male to 3.5 millimeter male audio adapter, which I got from AliExpress and the Insta360 mic adapter. So to set this up, I'm going to open up the battery door and plug in the Insta360 mic adapter. Then plug in this adapter and then plug in the Rode Wireless Go. And if I just show you a side view, if I line it up correctly, you'll see that the Rode Wireless Go is completely invisible in the stitch line. So now you can walk around your 360 camera completely hands-free and get really crisp and clear video and audio quality. 
Now, the reason I don't use this setup when I'm walking around with the selfie stick is because this can easily fall down. So I only recommend using this setup when you've got the 1R on a monopod and it's not gonna move. But yeah, that's it for this video. I hope you learned something new and do subscribe for more awesome 360 video tutorials and I'll see you guys in the next one.